Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to our virtual liturgy of the hour. Today is March 25, Monday, and our Sunday will be taken away from page L23. Antiphon 1 Jesus said, My heart is near broken with, with soul. Stay here and keep watch with me. Like the deer that yearns for running streams, so my soul is yearning for you, my God. My soul is thirsty for God, the God of my life. When can I enter the sea, the, the face of God? My tears have become my bread, by night, by day, as I heard it said all day long, Where is your God? These things, I, these things will I remember as a part of my soul. How I, I would meet the rejoicing crowd into the house of God amid cry of gladness and thanksgiving the throne one and with joy while cast up my soul while while rule with me hope in God my I will raise and steal my Savior and my God my soul is cast down within me as I think of you from the country of Jordan and Mount Hermon the hill of Mizar, deep is calling on thee, and the rolling waters, the torrent of all your waves, wept over me. By day the Lord will send his loving kindness, by night I will sing to him, praise the God of my God. I will say to, to God, my rock, why have you forgotten me? Why do I grow mourning oppressed by the poor? With Christ that pierced me to the heart. My enemies revealed me, saying to me all day long, Where is your God? Why you cast out my soul? Why you grew with me? Hope in, hope in God, I will raise him, still my Savior and my God. Glory be the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Father in heaven, when your strength takes possession of us, we no longer say, why you cast out my soul, so now that the surging waves of indication have passed over us, let us feel the hero plum of your forgiveness, and inspire us to yearn for you always, like the deer for running streams, until the satisfied every longing in heaven. Amen. When, when will I come to the end of my pilgrimage and enter the presence of God? And, or Jesus uh, said, My heart is near and broken with sorrow. Stay here and, and keep watch over me. Antiphon 2 Now the time has come from this world. To receive its sentence, now the price of this world will be driven out. Come to an aid, O God of the universe, and put all the nations in dread of you. Raise your hands against the head, that they may realize your power, as I ha have used us to show up, to show them your holiness. So now use them. To show us your glory, thus that they will know as we know that there is no God but you. Give new signs and work, work new wonders. Show forth the splendor of your right hand and arm. God and all the tribes of Jacob that they may inherit the land as of all. Show mercy to the people and call by your name. Israel, whom your name the firstborn, take pity on your holy city. City Jerusalem, your dwelling place, fill the sign with your majesty, your temple with your glory. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Now the time has come for this world to receive its sentence. Now the price of this world will be driven out. Antiphon G. Jesus, the beginning and end of our faith, enduring the cross, heedless of the shame, and it sent 
and he seated now at the right hand of the throne of God. The heavens proclaim the glory of God, and the permanent show forth the work of his hands. Day unto day takes up the story, and, t and night unto night makes known the message. No speech, no word, no voice is heard yet. Their expanse extends to all of the earth. Their words of the utmost bounds of the world. There he has a place of tent before the sun. It comes forth like a bright groom coming from his tent. Rejoices like a champion to run its course. At the end of the sky, it is rising on the sun in the furthest ends of the sky. It is course that there is nothing concealed from his burning heat. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. To enlighten the world, Father, you send to us your word as the Son of truth and justice. Shine upon mankind, illuminate our eyes, that we may discern your glory in the many works of your hands. Jesus, the beginning and, un and end of our faith, enduring the cross, he blessed of the shame, and is seated now at the right hand of the throne of God. A reading from the prophet Jeremiah. I like the trusting lamb lead to the slaughter. He had not realized that there were hatching hallows against me. Let, let us destroy the tree in its vigor. Let us cut him off from the hand of the living, so that he, his name will be spoken no more. But you, O Lord, God of hosts, just judge, snatcher of, of my and heart, let me, let me witness the vengeance you take on me. For, for you, I have I am trusted, trusted my cost, O Lord, my God. Responsibly, by your own blood, Lord, you brought us back to God. By your own blood, by your own blood, Lord, you brought us back to God. From every tribe and tongue and people and nation, you brought us back to God. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. By your own blood, Lord, you brought us back to God. Please all stand for the canticle of Zechariah, Antihor. Father, righteous one, um, the world does not know you, but I know you because you are the one who sent me. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us the mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. To his holy prophets he promised the goal that he will save us from our enemies. From the hands of all you hate us, he promised to show mercy to our fathers. And to remember his holy covenant. This was the oldest bones of Father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him in our fear. All the righteous and the sight, all our days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare this way, to give his people knowledge of salvation, by the forgiveness of their sins, in a tender compassion of all for God, the dawn upon high shall break up our us. To shine on those who dwell in darkness, and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was.
lost and the beginning is now and will be forever. Amen. <coughs> Father, the righteous one, um, the world does not know you, but I know you because you are the one who sent me. Intercessions. Let us pray to Christ our Savior, who redeems us by his death and resurrection. Lord, have mercy on us. You went unto Jerusalem to suffer and so enter into your glory. Bring your church to the Paschal over east of heaven. Lord, have mercy on us. You were lifted high on the cross and pierced by the soldier's pants. Heal our wounds. Lord, have mercy on us. You, have, you made the cross the tree of life. Give its fruits to those who were born in baptism. Lord, have mercy on us. On the cross, you forgive the repentant thief. Forgive our sins. Lord, have mercy on us. Our personal intentions. Lord, have mercy on us. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. All powerful God, by the suffering and death of your Son, strengthen and protect us. In our witness, we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. And may the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. The daily offering. O Jesus, to the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, words, joys, and sufferings of this day, in union with the holy sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world. I offer them for the intentions of your most sacred heart, for the salvation of souls preparation for sin and the reunion of all Christians. We offer them the intentions of our vision and all the apostles of prayer and are particular for those recommended by our Holy Father for this month, for the month of March. For new martyrs, let us pray that those who risk their lives for their gospel in various parts of the world might endure the church with their courage and missionary drive. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In therefore, peace the Lord is with thee. Was that up thou most be men of less, this the fruit of our Jesus. Only may our Mother God be for us in us now and be our Father. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The occasion prayer have it. Lord Jesus, I told the apostles, pray therefore the Lord of the harvest to send laborers to this harvest. We beg you, send many and holy priests and religious and analysis, and the whole world. Have mercy on us. Grant our Lord the grace of perseverance and fidelity, that those you have called, we trust in you. Mary, Mother of Vocations, pray for us. Saint Hannibal, pray for us. Saint John Vinny, pray for us. Saint O Lord, Holy Apostles, Saint Dear Church. Thank you very much to all of you for joining our liturgy at the hour morning prayer for tonight. Have a blessed Sunday morning to all of you and have a good have a blessed Sunday morning to all of you and have a good day to everyone. Bye.